Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Gulshan and in this video I will explain you about how to make a card view in Android Studio in a simple and easy way. So at the end of the video you can perfectly design your own card view in Android app. So let's get dive into your coding. So the first we have to open Android Studio. Click on start a new Android project. I whatever name you like give it to your project name I gave my card view okay I click next here I here ID is asking about which Android version you are which API version you list building for so I already choose go with that so I select blank MP activity next and same as that fish fish it will take a time to gathering all the classes and putting all things It will take a little time. Simply change Nexus 4 to Nexus 5. And this is Uh, right so as you guys know that our Android IDE interface so in this Java uh, here Java activity under the resources folder we have to click on layout and under the layout we have our activity file activity dot activity underscore main dot xml so in this xml we have to write code XML is a basically which the uh, user can be inter interface, user can interact. Okay, click next. Okay, clear this. Open up a view window. And let's start with the coding. So, first of all, I change with the relative layout to the linear layout. Then Let's start with the uh, set our Android orientation vertical. So the my app will be work in uh, vertical mode. So guys, when we start the first, you have to import this class. This is import this class into. You have to place this this code under the Gradle file. Build dot Gradle file compile com dot android dot score code view so uh, first I start with the relative layout so relative layout uh, match parent what have content so give it id dot id background android so we input the uh, Android background I give white background and uh, elevation for DP and provide padding sixteen DP so that's all okay under under this relative layout box I put my image view image view wrap content wrap content and give it I'm giving ID image card view image and 
I give uh, uh, inverted prop to and provide margin right using DP. So Android source driver I have to be and pull the image so I quickly move into my desktop so pictures I choose this into the android do have to simply click on a drawable folder and right click on this and simply paste copy and paste okay so i import my picture here i give to into a drawable so file so the picture is come Now let's make a text view to wrap content, wrap content, give ID, ID, and draw what we can title card view, yeah, yeah, title. So let's go right off to right. Of ID card view image, and then we have to give a line parent top. So after that, we have to reset padding, bottom padding, five DP. So so now after the text we have to give this card view so I give it my name version and drive and make it text size 24 SP I think yes. Okay. Another I make again text view. Web content, web content. IDE. Card view. In this description, I give it to. Hundred below, below of card view title, and I'll provide with the bed padding. I think the padding is done. So, invert text. So I give it text. Uh, what is uh, I provide three right and try to do your right get over your wrist and tutorials and examples for beginners and Exports. So I make the text uh, color. Simply choose I V A V. It's fine. 
Move it over. And to uh, make it to right of image view, card view, image. So that's point and forward view. Make it in. Now I have to import my Android V7 widget library so which we can initialize our card view. Good luck of that. So I simply write Android dot support dot v7 dot widget dot card then you have to go this and just run this in your in your So guys, here it is our card view, which we have successfully made. Thank you guys. So hope you like this my tutorial. So well that's for that's all for today. And if you like to practice more and please practice more, please visit on my blog. I mentioned the description for today. If you like to practice more, please visit on my blog, which I mentioned in the description box down below. And if you already yes, if you already done that. If you already done that, it will be great. And I will weekly post an Android video in my upcoming upcoming video, uh, upcoming Android application tutorial and tips and updates. Okay. And whatever I can find, and I give it to you. Other things you have, you can to check my other videos on Android app development, and you can connect it with me. On Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus, and finally, you can subscribe my channel. And last minute, but not least, what would you like to see next? You, do you want more Android videos? Let me know on comments. I will check. And looking forward to see you there. So, have a fantastic day and practice hard. Thanks. Thanks you so much.